How are you today, James? Do you hear voices, James? Of course I hear voices. This is a story about an actor who is no longer acting. James, you wouldn't want to get the store manager angry with you. No, I wouldn't want that. This is a story about his sister who floats in and floats out. A story about his friend and their neighbor. Over killing his father's wife. I've seen every episode up until you were fired. I wanted him to like Left. I, I left. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant to say. I want to make a pact. In the event that I die, I want you to finish my book. And if you die, I will finish your paintings and your sculptures. Oh, this is so interesting. Okay, in there? Sorry, uh, I'm his aunt. And uh, he isn't feeling well. I've his aunt? To... Uh, yes, kind sir, I, I'm his aunt. Come on, too. I've got to get him home. Sometimes when you dress up like a man, I get confused. It looks like a costume to me. Your mental illnesses are okay, but mine, mine are not. Catherine. I'm not even mentally ill. I'm just a person who wants to dress up like a guy <laughs> once in a while. That's all. Hey, hey, that's good enough for me. been a bit jealous of, uh, of you two and the decisions you've made for yourselves you know, about leading a creative life. Good enough, good enough for Everything needs to be made. It takes an artist to make it. Their greatest battles will be with themselves. Tell me what this says to you. Uh, it's about walls and floors. It's about walls and floors. Exactly what I was thinking when I painted it last night.